duckies and Lippy here back with another stream up video and this one has been something that Silverlink has created to help you guys get all our streamer products installed. You know how we mess about with plugins all the time? Well now it's created a super duper downloader that's super safe obviously because a guy like me is telling you about it like you know it's legit. Uh, and it's going to make it a lot easier for, to make sure you've got all the plugins and they're up to date. So let's just get into it. Put your rock over the stone. Let's go. Right, so to get this all downloaded, it's a standalone application. You don't need to install it or anything. So we're just going to get it from the stream up website just here. You won't see it on the latest products or go to products and then go to tools, all that jazz. It's not on there yet because obviously this is prior to release. So when you download it, you'll get this stream up plugin install a zip file. We're just going to extract all that. We're going to yeah put it wherever we want. Like I say, it is a standalone application. Well, batch file. So when we open the folder, you'll have a readme text that's going to explain everything that it does and also the plugins that we recommend slash use for all of our stream or products and you'll probably see excel Drive's name is there a huge amount so all credits go to them please make sure you do leave them uh, feedback and ratings on the obs forums so i'm going to close that down and all you need to do is run the the batch file or the PS1, uh, if you're just, uh, just doing just standard Windows batch file, I find that's the easiest way. All you gotta do is just double click it. It's gonna protect your PC, but it's cool, because Andy says it's cool. So we're gonna press run anyway. As long as the stream up one, it's fine. And you're gonna probably have this, it's gonna tell you a security warning. There's nothing to worry about, because we're not gonna overwrite any files or anything like that. This is just gonna basically download all the things uh, that we've told it to, which are the OBS plugins, and save them into an OBS Studio folder. So I'm just going to press R, and then press Enter, and this is going to run it. And you can actually see everything that it's doing just here. Silverlink's done a really good job of this. So it's going to download the Move Transition plugin, and it's just going to keep downloading all of these different plugins. Uh, it'll probably take about maybe five minutes. Depends on your internet, all that jazz. You know how it is. There we go, and once we're done, it's going to make sure you've got everything ready for stream effects as well, checking the yeah, redistributables. If not, it's going to get them all sorted as well for you. So this, basically, just make sure you've got all the most up-to-date plugins uh, of whichever plugins we use uh, stream up. So as soon as that's done, you can just press enter and it'll close that down. So as I said, this doesn't overwrite any of your files or anything like that. It creates this folder now. Uh, that says OBS the studio you can actually read the text document of everything that happened as well what this tool did so silver wanted to make it as open as possible to make sure you lot feel safe so we've got this OBS dash studio folder and it's got all these things just here which are all the plugins all in the relevant folders so all we've got to do to update our plugins now is copy this folder to wherever your OBS is so mine's in C drive program files uh, or it could be program files 86 obs studio just here so we're just going to paste directly into this folder and it's going to be like oh do you want to uh, overwrite um these files and like i said it is only the plugin files so you're like yep i want to update so that's going to replace all of these press continue on them all and that is it all the plugins that we use move transitions up to date all the plugins that are in that list all sorted up to date and you know that it's going to work with the stream up products it's as easy as that. It's a really nice, easy way for you to make sure you're all up to date. So before you kind of have any issues with the stream up products, you just run that, make sure you're all sorted. And then obviously if you've got any other problems, then come to the stream up discord. If you guys enjoy my content, then consider joining my Patreon. It helps me a ton make this content for you full time. Uh, big shout out to all my current patrons and also YouTube members. Consider pressing that join button down below. If you want to support stream up as well, then consider joining their Patreon uh, or just donate a little bit towards the products that you download on uh, coffee, Kofi, whatever you call it. And hopefully there's a video here for a great stream up product that I know you're definitely going to love. And it's completely free. All right, put your rock up the stone. I'll see you in the next one. Much love.